I added this X today. As you can see, got an eight inch bolt going right through. And that kind of works out because of the split, which I was worried about. And I added another four inch bolt through there with big fender washers because of that split. I should have had this post turned the other way. But either either it works out. I had to buy this one extra bolt because I was going to do this anyway. So that secures it this way. But I still have an issue. Here, I'll show you. It is strong going that way, but it wobbles this way. Should I attach it to the house? And if I do, that's going to have to be adjustable for when I adjust the panels. Probably adjust them four times a year at the... Uh, Winter solstice, summer solstice, no, the, uh, what's that called? The equinox. Yeah, so winter solstice, summer solstice, and the spring and fall equinox. The equinox is only about a week away, I think. So I'll be bringing these down a little bit. I'll put them at that tilt. But what should I do? Attach it to the top of the house? Or to the side of the house from the top here? And that has to be made adjustable? Or should I buy another nine foot post and drill right there and then go at an angle, cut a nine foot post into three sections and go down two feet. That's three more holes. That's six more feet of drilling. I didn't put the drill away yet. The auger. So another hole there. This looks good. This, the weak spot is the north and south wobble because it's top heavy it's a big wind sock the wind come along and snap that sucker off and the only thing that's holding it at the tilt right now is its uh, center of gravity and these posts are tight a strong wind will change the angle of it maybe i should leave it like that instead of having it snap off it would raise it up I'm still waiting for Amazon to deliver my inline 30 amp MC4 connector fuse and uh, forget how many amps it is, a switch. It has two inputs and two outputs. I don't know why I couldn't find a single switch just to break the circuit. It breaks both sides of the DC circuit, which is pretty stupid. Let's look at it from the corner of my yard. Watch for dog shit. Watch for landmines. That looks pretty good, eh? And I was worried that tree was going to shadow, and it's only shadowing a tiny little bit. That's why I don't want to put post on the front, because right now it's so easy to mow under and maintain. But I don't think I have a choice. So Monday. Hardware store's closed already, and they're closed Sunday. So Monday, one more nine-foot post. And... Probably buy another 12 foot pressure treated 2x4 if they have them. And a bunch of bolts. Gonna need a bunch more 6 inch bolts. I think I have some already. Nuts and bolts are expensive.